Here's how to fix Battlefield 6 lag or stuttering or FPS drops on PC in only 3 steps. So let's get it started. To do the first step, all you have to do is just go ahead and open Windows settings. You can use these solutions on Windows 11 or Windows 7. Just go ahead and type power options or power and sleep settings right over here. Then click on additional power settings. You should be able to see the option called high performance right over here. Just go ahead and select this option. If you have PC, you should be able to see the high performance option. And if you have laptop, just go down on your desktop, right click on battery icon from tax bar, or just go ahead and click on battery icon, and then you can change power mode from right over here. So first of all, just go ahead and change power mode to the high performance. Then go back to the uh, Windows settings, click on gaming, make sure to turn off game bar, and then go down and turn on game mode. Then guys, all you have to do is just go ahead and right click on this PC, and to the second step, just go ahead and click on advanced system settings, then click on settings, and now just go ahead and check this option, adjust for best performance. Then go down and click on apply, and then OK. Now guys, all you have to do is just go ahead and right click on your tax bar, click on tax manager, and just go ahead and close up uh, background processes, background applications from right over here to close background applications. Just go ahead and now, uh, select applications and then click on end task from right over here to increase your PC performance. And then guys, uh, to do the last step to fix this issue, all you have to do is just go ahead and update your graphic card driver and Windows to the latest version. To update your Windows, just go ahead and type check for updates on right over here, click on check for updates and you can update uh, Windows to the latest version from right over here. And to update your graphic card driver, if you have NVIDIA graphic card, just go ahead and search on your web browser, download GeForce Experience application, and then you can uh, update your graphic card driver to the latest version from GeForce Experience. And if you have AMD or Intel graphic card, uh, do the same thing, just go ahead and search on your web browser and download the latest version of your graphic card driver. Anyway, thanks for watching the video, I just will help you to fix this issue. Peace out.